All right, it's time for the new bracelet video. So I finally have everything ready. Uh, I needed about 180 runs just to get all the scales ready. And the reason why this took so long is that basically during the first week I wanted to get 300 trove keys and I figured I would be getting the resets from the trove. Well, I didn't. <laughs> and then next week, <clears throat> or was it the week after? Well, there was one week when I did four runs and I got only five oblivion fragments, which was super unlucky. So it pushed, pushed it back for another week. And then out of nowhere, NCSoft decided that uh, you need only eight Oblivion Fragments instead of 24. So I figured like, okay, well, I guess I'll wait yet another week. And here we are. I had to farm six extra scales just to get the, uh, the breakthrough, breakthrough bracelet. But I only had to spend eight Oblivion Fragments, so that was easy. Oh yeah, I have to destroy old build. So yeah, here we are finally, and this will be unedited, because my editor is kind of busy with things, and I don't know how to do it by myself. I don't have the programs and all that, so... I guess I put some timestamps or whatever down below, so you can click those, instead of watching the whole thing, I guess. Anyway, let's, let's start this. Upgrading, my favorite thing. Now here is the one interesting thing about this. Let's see, I'm using the correct things so I don't mess up. Yes. So what I heard was that usually you need only about 120 jewels. If you're a little bit unlucky, you need 140. But that's like the limit. But people were actually needing like 200 of these So we'll see what happens with that. I'm actually curious if they If it was a glitch or a mistake If they have fixed it or if it's still like that or if it's like I don't know a new path new path that uh, NCSoft is taking At least so far it seems uh, normal to me Anyway, I did, I did uh, two runs with the, uh, with the old bracelet. It doesn't have Psykes, and this new one I will not put uh, Psykes in, because uh, it wouldn't be fair if this new bracelet had Psykes and the old one didn't. But yeah, I was almost hitting 3 million, and both of the runs were super close to each other, so that's good enough for me. So I will also do two runs with this new bracelet. Uh, maybe even third one if I feel like I'm being unlucky or something. Also, we will be checking out what that extra effect means. The one that says that you get extra attack power, whatever. And cooldown is 20 seconds. So what I think it means is that you get, it's like the weapon, you get additional damage as a, like, attack power as it is additional damage. You get that, and you get that basically for, for which attack? Eradicate my RMP, okay. So every 20 seconds, one of my RMPs will hit harder than usually. So there is that. I have the combat thingy there. I'm, I'm basically ready to check that one out. Like with the weapon, like I did the, uh, the video thing, it's basically the additional damage is 
like every 15th hit, uh, one of your attacks will hit a little bit harder. So that's kind of pointless and meaningless. You don't even notice that in total DPS. Like, it's it's you don't notice it. That's it. And same thing will happen with this one. I guess your burst will be a little bit better because you because that one hits hits immediately when you start the fight. But still, it's kind of I don't know. It's, it's it seems so pointless to me. Not sure how hard it will be hitting, but we we will be checking. Let's see what is happening here. To me, this seems perfect, perfectly normal. So it was a glitch or mistake or something like that, because I'm needing exactly the same amount of legendary jewels that I needed before, but other people were needing a lot more. Oh, isn't that cute? Where is my jewels? Ah. <coughs> so, I need just one more, right? Do so 121 needed for that. So, it was a mistake that they fixed, and no one said anything about it, I think. People actually needed 200 jewels, like, like yesterday, and now they need less. Oh, I like that one. That's so funny. Fun facts. And there it is. And now I just uh, make it awaken three, just like my old bracelet. <clears throat> I barely had the jewels, Axel, that's pretty good. All the jewels I got from the trove. Trove paid off. And there we go. So. So that's basically what I was getting with old one. So let's see. Actually, let's first check this one out. So do I need to like first use execute and then it then it activates? I think so, yeah. So I do that and I hit once. Oh, it's like a lightning. Oh! Oh, I see. Wait a minute. So every every 20 seconds I will hit like 2 million. So that's like... Well, I mean, that, I guess that's noticeable actually. When you think about it, that's 100k for each, each uh, second. Wait a minute, that's actually useful. Like, that's actually something you can see. Hmm, interesting, interesting. That's not too bad, actually. Let's do that at the attack again. Let's use Fury as well. Oh, that lightning looks cool, though. Well, with Fury, of course, I hit more. So if that happens to happen with my... Uh, Soul and Fury in the same time, it's it's over two million. Okay, okay. That's that's not too bad. That's not too bad. It's not fully useless that I was thinking, but when considering you get nothing else with this, it's the same exact uh, multipliers with everything. The effect is a little bit better, but you actually lose one AP. That's the most 
That's the most funniest part, you lose one AP with the new bracelet. Of course you gain some other stats like critical and critical damage, but on top of that I lose the uh, the three set effect. So I lose 10 boss AP and 200 critical damage when I start to use this one. But then again, I basically gain a little bit crit damage after the loss anyway, and then chance to increase boss attack power, that one goes up, and the critical damage in that same thing will go up. So technically I guess you gain just a little bit, so you don't really lose anything, but... Still, it, it, it feels like the biggest boost actually comes from that first attack. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's the theory at least. Oh, yes, that's what I wanted to do, SS away. So my guess is that I will be probably making about 5% more DPS, maybe even 7%. But we'll see, we'll see. <clears throat> well, the burst is definitely bigger for obvious reasons, but I like that. Lightning effect is pretty cool. Could it be that I will actually get about 10% from this? Or was I just being super un super lucky with the start and then I get unlucky again? Now it's closer to that uh, 5%. Well, this run was actually quite unlucky. I'm not really getting the weapon resets at the moment. Now I'm actually gonna be like going under 3 million. Could it be that the lightning lines up better at the start for my skills and soul fury and all that? And then later on it gets desynced and I just don't get any extra damage because of that. it's another level of RNG. Didn't have enough of that yet in this game.
again, I didn't get weapon reset for a long time. <clears throat> Well, 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 well. Now that's uh, that's way less than what I was expecting, though. That's only two percent gain, by the way. Maybe I got really unlucky with that one. And I promised. I promised. Whatever happens, I will be, I will be fine. I will not be mad if I, if I uh, farmed for about 40 hours to get 2% DPS gain. I will be fine. I will, I will, I will be fine. I was just unlucky. I was just unlucky. We, we're gonna cut that one out. That never happened. Oh yes. I need to uh, get my ultimate for the start. There we go. Let's go again. weapon resets. This is even this is even worse luck now. Well, well, well. 
I refuse to believe this is uh, so useless. So, now it was only 1% better. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Because sometimes when you upgrade item, it might uh, glitch out, it doesn't apply something like it should. It happens, don't ask me why, don't ask me how. So we're gonna just log out like that and go back in. We're gonna do one more run. But if I don't see 5%, okay. I, will, I will I will be fine. I will be fine. I will not get mad this time that I, I farmed for uh, like 40 hours. I paid few thousand for this bracelet. I will be fine. The game is all about the burst, anyway. As long as you can make good bursts, then things will die. And this bracelet is pretty good for first uh, first two seconds. So. <laughs> 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 I, I don't want to play this game anymore. Bracelet used to be the best damage gain you can get. After the soul badges and mystic badges, of course, but... Oh man. Oh man, oh man. Bracelet used to be the best. And now it will be the worst. Tables have turned. One more run, okay. Let's let, let's hope that it was just glitched out somehow.
No, no, no. I'm gonna do that again. My weapon didn't proc for like first 10 seconds at all. And now... It's still not procking. Oh, finally, weapon proc. After 10 seconds again. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do this. Oh now there is a reset coming. Okay. And no weapon reset. Oh no.
Oh, that's painful. The last couple of seconds and I don't get... Okay, whatever. Well, let's call it 2% or maybe 3% gain. 40 hours of farming. I guess, I guess it could be worse. I guess it could be worse, but you know... Funny thing is, the pet gems that I will be getting this week as well, finally. Those pet gems is bigger DPS boost than this bracelet. Way bigger. Because you get about 4 to 5% AP. So that means 4 to 5% extra DPS. So that instantly wins the bracelet. On top of that, the pet gems. You will get a small amount of mystic and small amount of critical damage. So. Well then. I'm not mad. 40 hours of farming. It's fine. It's fine. In fact, I think if I would use these, these psychs on my old bracelet, I think I would deal more DPS with my old bracelet. With that old bracelet, with these psychs, more DPS. Just Probably not, like the difference would be just, it would be difference between the bracelets, it, it would be like half a percent. Like, this is ridiculous. Like I think if I would just, if I would just uh, get awakened stage eight Limitless soul pads, like even that would bring more DPS than this bracelet. Like anything, like if I would just get full square gems, like even that probably would give me more. <laughs> well, anyway, this has been going for 35 minutes. This is this is a fiesta again. Well, hit that like button if you like to see me suffer, and see you on the next one.